when we get to Proverbs chapter 10, is kind of slightly different structure now, where now you've got what's called the Proverbs of Solomon, where you've got proverb after proverb, contrasting being wise with being foolish. And it makes sense, because if, if you remember when we had the personification of wisdom, uh, you might have noticed that then in the next chapter you had the personification of folly. And so there's always like two voices speaking to you, a wise voice, a foolish voice. And if you act wise, there's one outcome. And if you act foolish, there's another outcome. And that's what we're going to see throughout the Proverbs now, these, these two outcomes. And in a sense, the choice is ours, whether we're going to be wise or foolish for how a lot of our life is going to go